Ammonia free hair dyes are marketed as chemical free hair dyes. To a consumer, it might seem that these hair dyes can neither cause any damage to your hair or hair dye allergy. But the reality is quite different. In this video, we are going to talk about the truth behind ammonia free hair dyes. So if you want to be your own hair care expert, keep watching. But why is ammonia part of hair dye? For that, you should know the hair structure. The hair is something like this. It, is, it has an outer covering known as the cuticle and it has an inner core which is known as the hair shaft which is made up of the cortex and the medulla. For any hair dye to last longer, it has to go inside the inner core of the hair which is this and for that to happen it should open up the cuticle so this opening up of the cuticle and uh, damage to the cuticle is done by ammonia and a similar compound known as ethanolamine so if you have any hair dyes containing any of these compounds it will damage your cuticle it will eventually make your hair more porous and more prone to damage the second argument that i want to give Fourth is that ammonia is not the only chemical present in the hair dye. In fact, it is not the most important chemical present in the hair dye. The chemical that is actually responsible to color your hair into different shades of uh, black, blue, brown and blonde is something known as PPD and other para compounds. And these are the chemicals responsible for hair dye allergy. So, even your ammonia-free hair dyes can cause hair dye allergy. In the next video, we are going to cover hair dye allergy in a little detail. Till the time, be beautiful, be influential.